like the video and subscribe right now, or Spider will be in your room tonight. What is up, guys? It's your boy Dex FB. I know y'all hear the vocals, man. And today, bro, today, my guy, I'm showing y'all how to play post defense, baby. And you see right there, that's a goaltending, bro. But you know, that's not, that's not the point, my guy. So I'm going to tell you the badges that you need, the things you need to do, so you can be successful playing defense in the post. Because I am a six-nine rebounding wing. I'm kind of low down there in the post, but it really doesn't matter, bro. The badges that I'm about to tell y'all, and the things I'm about to tell y'all, will help y'all become a godlike post defender. So first thing first, bro. First thing first, my guy. You need pogo stick. That is the probably that's the best badge in the game, honestly. If you have pogo stick, whoo, you will be able to defend in the post like freaking the Kimbe Matumbo. You can just spam Y, honestly, and you will get every single block. So number one is pogo stick. That is, if you're playing, if you're in the post anyways, you need that badge. Even if you don't want, if for some reason, if you don't want to be a good post defender, still get pogo stick. That's just like, you know how humans need air? Well, post defenders need pogo stick. You know what I mean? It's like, it's kind of like, okay, y'all get the point. Number two, y'all need to get freaking, what's it called? Get rim protector. That is a very important bet. Honestly, it's more important than Intimidator, and I will get into that later. If you pair a rim protector, gold rim protector, with bronze Intimidator, you will become a defensive god. Intimidator is not a good badge, y'all. I repeat, it is not a good badge. Rim protector, gold, and um, Intimidator bronze will literally change your defensive life. I used to have Intimidator on Hall of Fame, and I didn't have Pogo Stick, and that's why I was playing horrible, atrocious, James Harden 2017 type of defense but now I put it as rim protector gold and intimidator bronze and now I can play really good post defense and as you see right there that's literally just pogo stick in action but you know no one wants to listen to me so yeah whatever but that's just free game right there so get rim protector gold and intimidator bronze <laughs> that is number two number three is moving truck because some some big men like to mash they like to monster mash, you know what I'm saying? They like to they like to get down low. And that's really not, I mean, that's not an issue if you have moving truck on silver. Me, I only get 17 defensive badges, or 20, 17 or 20 defensive badges. And I can't really be wasting it a lot, so I only get it on silver. And that badge works perfectly for me. I use it on twos, I use it on threes. Whenever they see me, they're like, oh, I'm finna mash on this boy. I'm like, nah, 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 no, you're not, bro. I can hang with you. I can hang with you. I can contest you. I can do all that. And with that badge, you do not need post move lockdown. That badge is horrible. It's bad. And honestly, people really don't do post move. The only real post move they do is a drop step. And if you have more than a two IQ, you'll know when they're doing a drop step. You know what I mean? So get post move lockdown so they just can't body you. Because bodying is the biggest issue in this game and position and all that stuff. And if you get post move back, not post move lockdown, moving truck you will be like a bulldozer down there you will not be getting moved it's actually quite crazy how much that badge changed my twos game and my threes game because going against um what's it called paint beast they would always try to mash and it was the most annoying thing ever and then i decided to get moving truck and it changed my life you know so that is number three you feel me and next is just literally just having iq i know it sounds cliche but the more more IQ you get, the more you'll know what to do. If you see someone going in paint and mashing and stuff, just use your pogo stick. Spam the Y. I know it sounds bad, man, but just spam Y. You're going to get the block with pogo stick, man. And you have rim protector and intimidator on bronze, bro. You're going to get the block. You're going to get the contest. As long as you're tall. As long as you're over 6'8", six, 6'8 eight, six, eight and over, you're going to be good, my guy. Don't worry, okay? Just do what I told you in this video. I try to tell you everything I know in a short, quick amount of time. So, you don't, I'm not wasting y'all's time. So, yeah, that's that's the video, y'all. And if you like rebounding wing content, if you like rebounding wings, all that type of stuff, defense, all that type of stuff, I'm your guy, okay? I post daily on weekdays. 
and on weekends I stream so this weekend I'll be streaming and if you like the video like and subscribe for more and I'm out